Dear colleagues, I would like to introduce an article titled Morphological Response of the Leaf Blades of Battle of Pandora to the Influence of Man-Made Environmental uh, a reliable and informative method to assess the impact of factors of man-made uh, influence on living organisms is a bioindication approach. A particularly promising area of bioindication research is phytoindication, which involves the diagnosis of the state of ecosystem by the plant component of this ecosystem. The aim of our research is bioindication of ash and slag dumps of Burston Tama Pavel plant. Storage of ash and slag waste causes a number of environmental problems, transforming of natural geochemical cycles, change of natural radioactive background due to increased concentration of radioactive isotopes in coal combustion products and many other problems. Uh, as an experimental species for selected battle pendulum. During the research, the morphological features of the leaf blades of the experimental species were studied. We compared the morphological reactivity on the industrial sites of ash and slag dump number 3 of Burston Tama Power Plant and on the protected area, Galician National Nature Park. Uh, the leaves were digitized and the coral draw program was uh, used uh, to measure leaf parameters. Uh, we defined the elongation coefficient and the shape coefficient, also the index of fluctuation asymmetry. Biometric uh, analysis of da data were performed by method of mathematical statistics. The results of this study indicate a difference on the level of variability of foliar parameters of battle pendula under the condition of ash and slag dumps of bush ten thermopower plant and in the territory of um, reference ecosystem. Uh, it was found that the modification of foliar parameters under man-made condition and without its uh, condition is not the same. Uh, the most uh, variable feature is the distance between the first and the second vein. On the territory of ash and slag dumps, the coefficient of variation of the indicator uh, is uh, 32.8 to 36.3%. However, this feature uh, shows increased variability both at high levels of antiprop oppression and in a relatively clean area is also high. The average variable parameters is the length of the first and second veins from the base of the leaves. Under the condition of fashion slag dumps, the coefficient of, of variation for the length of the first vein is 22.3824.7%, uh, while in the background is 17.0270%. Uh, uh, regarding, regarding the uh, second vein, uh, its variability under stress is 24.04-24.9%. The reference area is 14.7-19.08%. Uh, the average variable indicator is the angle between the central and the first vein processing. 17.5-17.9% uh, for the background area and 17.03-17.85% uh, uh, under stress condition. And the angle between the central and the second vein in the reference ecosystem and its setting point 8 and, uh, set, uh, and on the territory of fashion slag dumps 15.6-19.8%. Uh, as a result of the study, the elongation coefficient uh, and the shape coefficient of battle pendula leaf plates were calculated. Exceeding of the elongation coefficient of the uh, unit indicates uh, a stable environment in situa situation uh, exceeds uh, the unit level. Uh, the shape coefficient was used to estimate the modification of the leaf blade shape. Uh, the shape coefficient for 
but the pendulum on the Ashen Slack dumps is higher by 0.14 compared to the territory of reference uh, ecosystem. Uh, also, um, the, start, uh, the change in the shape of the leaf plate uh, causes a high ratio of the upper and lower parts of the leaf plates in the sample of ashen slag dumps in comparison with the territory of reference ecosystem. Uh, also, we uh, studies the change in the shape of the leaf blades. The normal shapes of the petal pendula leaves is rhomboid ovate and uh, tri triangle rhom uh, rhombic. The appearance uh, of heart shaped and oval shaped uh, was recorded uh, record. on the territory of ashen slag dumps. However, in a percentage terms, atypical forms are a, a minority, 6.4%. Uh, uh, the leaves of battle pendula trees growing off on ashen slag dumps suffer from necrotic uh, lesions. Uh, the most common necrosis is on the uh, periphery of the leaf blades. Necro uh, necrosis occupies approximately 14.1% uh, of the assimilated surface. Uh, it's 2.05 uh, square centimeters in the absence of made factors. It's 1.32% uh, uh, of the assimilation surface. Uh, during the study, the coefficient of fluctuation asymmetry due to the area of the right and left halves of the leaf blades were determined according to the results of measurement on the territory of the ashen slag dams of Bushton Tama power plants. The level of fluctuation asymmetry averaged 0.052. On the territory of the reference ecosystem, the level of fluctuation asymmetry uh, is 0.034. So, uh, in the course of the study of the reactivity of morphological parameters of leaf blades of battle pendula, a significant decrease in foliar parameters and modification of indicators of variability of morphological features under the influence of factors of, ant of ashen slag dumps of Bushton Tamapal plant were uh, recorded. The most variable features in both areas was the distance between the first and the uh, second vein. A high rate of variability under stress is characterized by the length of the second vein and the angle between the central and second vein. These foliar parameters can be used in view indication studies as high sensitive markers uh, of the state of the environment. The elongation co uh, coefficient does not differ in the two studies areas and it's approximately 1.3. Uh, the coefficient of shape on the territory of fashion slag dumps of Bushton Tama power plant is uh, 0.84 and reflects the change in the shape of the leaf blades under the influence of man-made load factors and can be used as bioindication marker. There is a decrease in the area of the assimilation apparatus with a um, uh, simul simultaneous uh, with a simultaneous um, I'm sorry uh, increase on the level of necrotic le lesions. 14.1% uh, of the assimilation surface under the condition of growth on the ashen slag dumps of Bushton Tama power plant. There is high level fluctuation asymmetry 0.052 under the condition of man made environmental of Bushton Tama power plant. Thank you for attention.